What's going on guys? It's Nate up here and today we'll be talking about my drug addiction. I did a video on it like briefly. I want to show you exactly everything I said to be honest in that video to be honest. So I'm just going to lay it all out my journey I guess. I don't, I don't really know what you want to call it to be honest with you. So and we're going to have be having a session. So I spilled last video I spilled my soda everywhere and yeah. I usually do these in bulk, if you guys are wondering. <laughs> now, everyone does it differently, so this is how I like to do it. I like to edit all in one and record all in one. I don't, I don't know why, but then just edit as I go. It first, like, started out with... It started off with blue booze, not blues. Not blues clues, all y'all last. Sorry, shut what? Oh, snap, okay. I didn't call my ass down, okay. Yeah. It's, it started off with booze. I started off with like blue UV and stuff like that with my friends. Then I got turned 21. I would get bottles of Jack a lot. I would get the big ass ones. Then weed's not really bad. I don't, I don't, I don't see what's wrong with it. I live in Wisconsin and they fucking they legalize this shit. But that's besides the point. This is not what that's about. Then I had weed for the first time when I was. I don't, I don't remember what, what how old I was. I think it was in 8th grade to, or ninth. I'm not totally sure. But after that, I like smoked hella weed. I, weed is the best one. I don't care what anybody's. Um, acid's good and shrooms are good. But if I, I just feel more comfortable high. I, I don't know. Probably because I'm fucked up in the head. But it's okay. <laughs> um, then it, when I was in college, I like started experimenting with like LSD and shrooms and stuff like that. I only had shrooms once, so it's not like I'm an expert or anything about it, but I have done acid a lot. Uh, a funny story, I'll just say this. Oh uh, yeah, it's a funny story. Me and my friend and Another friend, I'm not totally sure what. We were um, driving to a, a reggae concert. It was in Madison. It was at the, I'm not sure exactly where it was. I think just off of the main strip uh, in downtown. We were driving to that and my friend and I just had, um, just took three tabs of acid and I was in the driver's seat. I was driving and my buddy was in the, um, what the fuck am I trying to say right now? He was in the passenger seat and the designated driver was in the back. And I don't know how I didn't get pulled over. Like this, I I'm still trying to like think about this. Like how I didn't get pulled over. Like it was literally felt like I was in like a racing game and it just felt like I was in a, uh, a game. Like I would, I would go really fast. Then I would slow way down. Then I, it was like off and on, off and on, and off and on. And... I, I don't know how I didn't get pulled over. Uh, that it just blows my mind still. But then we came up to some cones. Okay, you know the cones that like they're they have the bottom. They're like the the bottom circle joint, and it's like this looks really bad. But it's like a long ass tube like this. Oh shit! Don't. Oh snap! Oh okay. This is a pen. Okay, let's use it. But it's a it's a long ass one, and I it was like a strip of those for like it had to be like five to ten miles. I don't know how long it was, but I'm like, I was like, I was like just looking around, and there was just cops everywhere, like everywhere. And that we were like, I pulled over where there wasn't any cones, and I'm just like, I can't do this, dog. Like I'm, <laughs> this is intense. So we got. The designated driver came in, and I was just in the back seat, just like, oh my god, dog. We had to go somewhere before we went to the show, but that that day was fun. It was a fun day, though. It was fun as hell, though. Like I would do it again for sure. It was it was scary, but it was it was intense as shit. Yeah, we'll have a fun time. Just, okay, kids, if you're watching this, don't. I lo I love you guys. Shit, I love all you guys watching this. I love all of you. Shit. Like you, you don't even understand. You pro you probably understand. Like seriously, okay. But I seriously love you guys. All the support you show me. If you guys have any recommendation videos or like anything like that, 
I am trying I am working on merch right now I'm just trying to um, figure out some difficulties I know I had a website up but it unfortunately got taken down so I will be doing merch again um, let me know what you guys want to like see do you like hoodies beanies and all that jazz just let me know what you guys would like to see um, I'll probably do release all my designs I had on the store already you guys don't have to worry about that and I'll at least the ones that I was working on as well for the big drop I will keep you posted on my Facebook page and throughout these so I, I love doing these set I'm chilling with you guys set dog sorry I'm not, I'm not a vlogger for any means but sometimes it's fun to just I just want to take you a day in my life, you know what I'm saying? This is like video game related, but I've been playing Elden Ring. Who know who, that game is, it's so good, but oh shit, it gets you pissed off. My controller is fucked up now, because I've thrown it. Okay, today I was playing it, and it's about drugs, dog. What am I doing? Um, 